ask someone who the most influential person is in their life, they might answer with some famous celebrity or some like old uh, historian. But for me, that is not the case. The most influential person in my life, hands down, has got to be my mom. My mom has been a very important figure in my life. She has helped me achieve so much with the way she bestows confidence within me and the way she points me in the right direction if I'm ever feeling conflicted. But arguably, one of the biggest gifts that my mom has given me is that she helped me discover my passion for theater. Throughout my life, my mom has helped me discover the benefits and pleasures that both being on stage and participating in a high school sport can bring. But ultimately, I opted to stay with doing theater. With the help of my mom, I was able to find my passion for acting. Middle school was when I first found that I had an interest in theater. My mom had been a part of this small community theater troupe based in Riverside, Illinois, for much of her life. So every year or so, I would go see my mom play some quirky character on stage in front of an audience. And watching her do this would fascinate me. So one day, my mom suggested that I come join the company that she was in and be a part of her, or be a, play a role with her on stage. And because of her telling me this, I did. I soon realized that I really liked theater and acting on stage, but at this time in my life, it wasn't something I was too good at, so I decided to give other things a try. With high school approaching, my mom suggested I try out for a sports team there, and soccer being a sport that I have played in before, I decided to try out for the soccer team. Soccer was a sport that I really did enjoy playing, and after trying out my freshman year, I made the team. My first year of high school soccer was great. I was a starter, I became more hip with my fellow classmates, <laughs> and playing a sport kept me in shape. But nothing lasts forever. As time went on, my relationship with the coach, coach slowly depleted. He started to favor other players that played my position, and other players progressively got better than me. So, at the beginning of my junior year, I was cut from my high school soccer team. Feeling devastated, I didn't know what to do. So, fast forward a few years. At the beginning of my senior year of high school, my mom suggested that I should get back into theater and try out for the musical. She said she never really understood why I stopped performing to begin with, because she thought that I had a knack for acting and that I was good at it. And at first, I wasn't very willing to try out for the musical, but ultimately, I agreed to do so. Theater had been something I very much enjoyed, but it had just been so long since I've been a part of some production that I was just like rusty. But I was also aware of our school's extremely talented students that participate in the fine arts department, so for me, getting a role seemed like a long shot. Nevertheless, I went to auditions and gave it my all. After that, the only thing to do was just be patient and wait. After a few nerve-wracking days, the cast list went up, and much to my surprise, I got one of the lead roles in my very first musical at my high school. After seeing this great news, I felt nothing but happiness, and knew that from that moment on, I should keep doing theater. As a result, with the help of my mom, I was able to find my passion for theater. It was my mom who pushed me to come out of my comfort zone when she asked me to perform with her on stage. It was also my mom, that pointed me in the right direction of playing a high school sport, which didn't really go anywhere, but helped me find my real passion, and it was a good experience to have in life. It's also my mom who suggested to me that I try out for the school musical, which was, without a doubt, the highlight of my high school career. In short, my mom is the most influential person in my life because of everything she has done for me and how she introduced me to the wonderful world of acting and theater. Thank you.